welcome to your Salmon Arms Silverbacks game day preview presented by The Wood Shop for Saturday, October 24th. Tonight, your backs have a rematch with the Penticton Bees after a very close tight game yesterday. Your backs enter action tonight with a record of 1-5-1. The Bees are 9-0. First, let's recap. The backs opened the scoring last night. For this the second time in the Okanagan Cup, it was Matt Borgo getting his first goal in the BCHL, hopped on a bad turnover from the Bees, a pass up the middle, and he quickly snapped a shot past the blocker side of Yaniv Peretz for his first tally in the BCHL. The Bees did score two goals quickly early in the second period, two goals in a span of 48 seconds at 5-on-5. Five five. It was Williams first and then Quillen to make it 2-1, but just over four minutes later, Drew Bennett on a power play tied the game for the Silverbacks after a shot from the point from Joaquim LeMay. Bennett was right there in front to backhand home, shovel home the rebound to tie it at two for his third of the Okanagan Cup. In the third period, a lot of back and forth, both goalies strong, Riley Kahonik and Yaniv Peretz. However, in the end, Jackson Niedermeyer did get the game-winning goal with just under three minutes remaining. He got a pass out front from Quinn Hudson and put it over the glove side to give the Bees the victory. Second thing of note from last night's game, well, the backs very strong in the defensive end. They were very good at blocking shots, sticks and lanes. They were hard on the Bees in the corner. Uh, playing the body, and so we'll see if they can replicate that performance from a defensive perspective here tonight. Third thing of note, your Silverback player to watch, powered by Twin Anchors. This evening, it is forward Cameron Recchi. He made his debut last night for the backs, and even though he didn't show up on the score sheet, he definitely had his impact felt. He was blocking shots. He was good and smart in his own zone, making those safe plays in the right spots. Had a couple good chances as well. He's dangerous. He's a little nifty. Even though he's not the biggest player, he is your Silverback a player to watch tonight, powered by by Twin Anchors. How to tune in tonight, of course, it's the usual. Hockey TV will live stream the game with puck drop set for 6.30. We'll be on the air at 6.15, and we will also have a free radio stream at Mixler.com forward slash SA Silverbacks. You can tune in there as well. This has been your Silverback Game Day Preview presented by The Woodshop.